So in a quick video, I got a question on how you can do some DJ drops if uh, you don't uh, like your own voice or if you don't have a mic or something like that. And my answer was, well, sometimes you can uh, do a, a text to speech and then uh, then maybe work it over a little bit afterwards. So I think I'll do two here, one female and one male. So I, I go to, for instance, this one from texttospeech.com. That's just an example for a free one. And I put in my DJ name or one of them. And then I select the voice, let's choose Daisy and then British English. And I say, create all your file. And then it can take up to a minute, so, so bear with me. Oh, it's fast, it's time. And then I download the audio file, of course. Klaus the Mighty M. And it says, Klaus the Mighty M. My name, basically, in British English. So we'll just keep that and just download it. And I'll do another one. Uh, well, I'll choose just US English and I'll choose, let's say, John. That's fine. And create another audio file. This little while again. And I'll download that one. Klaus the Mighty Am. So that's a male voice. The female voice will just keep for this for the sake of this video, but the male one voice will do a little bit with. So what I do is I uh, I open I open up uh, uh, Audacity here, which is a free software uh, that anybody can get, and it's for editing audio. Let me just make it a little bit smaller, maybe. That. That's fine here. So what I basically can just do is just go to my uh, my download folder here, and I can just grab the two latest ones. So I was going to keep the female one and then change the male one. So I'm going to put this in here. So here I have the same sound. Klaus the Mighty M. Well, that's actually the female one. Let me get the other one. Klaus the Mighty M. That's it. So this one, do this, and now we'll do a pause after Klaus. Klaus the... And maybe here. The Mighty M. Oh, maybe here. The Mighty M. Like that. And I'll say, well, in here, you should put in some silence. Maybe half a second. So we see something like that. Klaus, the mighty am. Like that. And then I'll put in some more silence at the end because we need that for the effect we're gonna add. So I put in some more silence and for now I'll just put in five more seconds. That's fine. We're just gonna edit that in a second. So like that. So now it's long, it has a long tail. Like that. Let's shrink it a little bit. So now we have all of it. And what we're gonna do next? Well, next I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, pitch it because that's one of the effects I want to do. So I'm gonna pitch this thing, change the pitch, and for instance, take it down by six semitones, and choose high quality. Do that. So now he should have gotten a lower voice. Close. The mighty arm. Like that. And then it's basically ready for my uh, effect generating. So I'm gonna mark all of it again. And I'm gonna put some echo on it. That's probably fine. Of course, you can change and turn it in you want. So now we have this. Close, close, close. The mighty arm. Arm, 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 arm. That's fine. And maybe a bit of reverb. There's also a ton of settings you can set. We'll just take this default for now. So now we have a little bit of reverb too. Close, 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 close. Like that. And then uh, you probably want to normalize it because it's a bit low. So I'll do effect, normalize, up to zero to B, like that. So then we have close, 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 close. And we can also hear what we should probably start at five seconds. So something like that. Just remove this. And then this is actually 
ready. So we'll just export it. Just put it back in the download folder, basically. So that'll be probably, sorry. Okay. So I'll put in mail, DJ drop, like that. Clear that, we don't need that. That's okay. And I'll go back to the downloads folder and then I'll take the other one and say female DJ drop like that. So now we should have both of them. And the very basic female one. Klaus the mighty M. Which you can of course also edit in uh, Audacity if you want to. So what's next? Well, then we're gonna throw them into virtual DJ. That's down here, and we have a. Uh, this is what my test, uh, my test sampler pack. So I'm gonna throw it in here. From here, grab these two. Throw them in here, and some sense of an update. Now they're there, male and female. Didn't get the best name. We can change that in a second. So now we have them here. <laughs> And the same with the female one. Klaus the mighty M. So we'll just edit that for name. This was already there. So it should actually change. Just a little bit like that. So now we have uh, the male and the female DJ drop here. And let's try playing it on top of something. That sounds okay, maybe. Klaus the mighty M. It's a bit low. And then if we try to play it on top of a track, that's, that's up and running like this one. Klaus the mighty M. Klaus the mighty M. You'll see that both of them are low. So the female one, I'm gonna put the game all the way up. It doesn't matter that it's flipping a little bit. It's, it's, it's just a drop. It's supposed to be on top of that stuff, stuff. And this one, I'll turn up to three or five. Like that. And now they go a bit, a bit harder. And the clean female one. Klaus the mighty M. So something like that. So that's a really quick way of doing a, an online uh, text to speech, and then uh, taking one of them and throwing it uh, through uh, Audacity to add a little bit of effect and change the pitch and uh, also normalize it a little bit. You could of course do the same with the female one, uh, but I chose to just do it clean. Then uh, get it into a, a sample pack and maybe uh, change the name and maybe turn up the volume uh, a little bit of the samples so that they cut through whatever music you plan to throw them on top of. So that's it.